Now in this tutorial, you're going to learn how to build your email list from scratch. Now we're going to talk about a few things here. We're going to talk about finding a good topic, finding a good list name, and acquiring a valuable freebie related to your topic that you can give away and you can build your list with. Now we're going to give you a brief overview of list building, but we're going to go immediately and dive into actually building your list so that you can get up and running and get started. So the big question is why do you need to build a list? So you've heard that the money is in the list. Now the most important thing when you begin and you start out is that you need to focus on building that relationship with the people on your list. Now not only that, when you build a relationship with them and you can help them out and you will begin to see that your list and the people on your list actually will actually be able to start helping you they'll start teaching things to you that you never knew to help you improve your business you know they're gonna give you stuff like constructive criticism and you're gonna be able to improve your support and the way you do things so that you can improve your business and further reach future markets now by building a list you're gonna be able to see what people need in that niche and you're gonna be able to give it to them. and by helping them they're gonna help you so it's two-sided it's not all one-sided so another big question is what is your list going to be about now to get started the first thing you want to know is what your topic is going to be about now this is usually where most people will get stuck but don't worry after you view this video you're gonna think it's really easy to do now another thing to note is that you need to find something of those topics and make sure that it's something that you're passionate about make sure that you enjoy it you're gonna have fun with it because when you start writing those newsletters and emails to your list you know you need to be excited about it otherwise your list is going to notice and they might not even want to be on the list so write it and find something that you enjoy because if you do that you're gonna be able to help those on your list at the same time when they send you emails you're gonna be excited to answer their emails and you're gonna be happy to help them and by doing that their relationship with you is going to grow and grow and grow and you'll increase your conversion rates just by doing that okay so let's now get started with actually finding a list of topics that you actually enjoy writing about so now we're here at the step of brainstorming and to do that what I would recommend you do is open some sort of text editor whether it be WordPad, Notepad or Microsoft Word any type of text editor so I'm gonna go ahead and open Notepad here what you want to do now is you want to list as many topics as possible that you enjoy and most importantly you know about so you want to have topics that you're interested in and don't worry about different topics just just put anything that's in your head onto the paper so you can even write this out with pen and paper if you like or you could do notepad So I got a topic list here, and uh, as you can see, I started out with internet marketing, affiliate marketing, selling products, producing software, and it, it does not always need to be business related. It can go into dog training, puppy training, and German Shepherd dog training, and uh, other hobbies that you enjoy. Uh, I went into running, jogging, tennis, marathon, now after you finished a list of topics that you're interested in and you know about, you can start narrowing it down by picking out and choosing problems that people face so that we can have a subject dash problems. And then if I, I choose a subject topic here in internet marketing, and then I'll choose a problem that people face. So as you can see here, I've compiled a list of topics of the subject matter on the left side, 
here and the problems that people can face or not necessarily problems but things that prove on and avoid now generally the more specific your niche is the higher conversion rates you have because the mo more focus that your list is going to be about something such as German Shepherd dog training there are specific needs that a German Shepherd has and the problems that they face so if you get people on your list that are having interest in this uh, sub niche then you can teach them things and you can also sell them things at the same time that will improve the lives not only their lives improve the lives of their German Shepherds health and needs now how do we know that you know this niche is going to be profitable or not uh, one way is that you can actually go to uh, Google and you can do a d research on these keywords so let's say here that I'm gonna do German Shepherd dog training and I have this special interest in German Shepherd dog training and it's something that I like writing about and I have my own dogs that are German Shepherds or I could either choose something like Marathon and you can see the German Shepherd dog training has uh, 1 million searches on 1.8 million in fact and we have marathons here and that's 50 million so your competition's quite high uh, but at the same time uh, you know it's a profitable niche so in this case I'm gonna go ahead and go use example of German Shepherd dog training so even within the German Shepherds we have 2.9 million so let's go ahead and use this as an example and uh, what we're going to do is set up a landing page and uh, set up an autoresponder so that you can actually see uh, this in action and if we go back to the notepad uh, where we listed out the topics this is mainly a brainstorming technique just to show you uh, the different problems that people face so that you can actually relate uh, in, to it an easier way so you can list it all out and pick and choose you know whether it's going to be a general niche or sub niche and sub niches actually are uh, better if you for conversion rates so we're going to go ahead and do the German Shepherd dog training second thing that we want to do is figure out a name for the list and a few helpful words can be tips advice and secrets so I can go about naming it German Shepherds training secrets okay great now that we know the list name we can go about to finding a product or something that's free out there or you can produce something of your own in this case I produce something that has to do with German Shepherds and it has a little few tips and now it doesn't need to be anything elaborate it just can be something like a report something short like a five page or a six page report that shows people that own German Shepherds how to train their dogs I'm gonna give them a follow-up series that will teach them uh, so I can gain their trust the main thing here lastly is to be able to find something uh, whether you produce it or whether it be private label uh, materials or something that you can access that has resale rights materials as well so you can take a bunch of articles that have private label rights and you can go to Google and we'll go there actually right now so if I go to Google here and uh, I type in something like German Shepherd private label articles then you're probably going to likely to find a lot of articles on you can already see here German Shepherd private label and private label what that means is that uh, you're given rights to actually edit the articles change the articles to whatever you like it to be and now you need to make sure that you have private label rights to it so that you can actually change it and put your name on it and that way it gives you a step beyond having writer's block so when you're stumped about what to write about it you can actually get a starting point and improve what you see, receive in those articles so 
now that we have gone over a few things here, you know what it's going to be about, you know the name, and you know where to get the materials. So in the next few videos, you're going to learn how to get all the tools that you need to set up a landing page, an autoresponder, to start building your list.